Mellow Yellow. Oh! <gasps> Mellow Yellow has a team member that has shot off the side of the- How does that happen? What's up everybody? My name is Scotty. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are on event 11. Just as I thought. I just wanted to double check. It's going to be the swing wave or the wave I think it's called. So let's get into it. Also, oh wait, okay, I'm, I'm glad I reminded myself before I started. I don't know if anybody's taking me really, really seriously with these videos. I want everybody to know that I'm not actually mad. I'm not actually molding. I'm not actually crying myself to sleep at night over this. It's just the Marble League. Like, it's not just the Marble League, you know what I'm saying? But it's, it's just the Marble League. I'm not... <laughs> personally offended by any events that have taken place. I'm just saying this because I've gotten a few weird comments from people that I felt like were, were a little unnecessary. I do love the Marble League. I do love the Midnight Wisps. But at the end of the day, even my beef with the old Rangers is not really beef. Like these are marbles, bro. I'm not actually mad. But <laughs> anyway, if y'all take this way more seriously than I do, that's fine, but just so you know, I'm not that deep with this, okay? It doesn't run that deep for me. <laughs> anyway, let's get into the video. Team Galactic has four gold medals? What? I at least need the green ducks to get a top three finish for Marble League because Midnight Wisps are clearly not going to do it for us this year. Red catch basin. You'll notice each of the dips in the wave. The valleys correspond to a point total, but the basin does not. And that's why you see the two that ended up there get a big zero apiece. So yes, keep that momentum as far as you okay. can. Okay, I see, I see. So this isn't like balancing where you want to get to the end. Okay. I know this event is not new, but for some reason I don't remember it. Oh, stay, yes. Good, nice. It's a very solid start for the Green Ducks. That should help them. Quite a bit, oh yes, 33 to 23 here in heat one of 16. Now an interesting wrinkle that you will notice, unlike some of the other track events that we've seen, like block pushing or even the relays, is there's no barrier to separate these two teams. So you will see some argy bars. Some collisions. Physicality. <laughs> Cosmo. In addition, we haven't forgotten about you. <laughs> oh no. And they've shed two of the green ducks. Okay, that was solid though. The second ten made up for it, but Savage Speeders kept everybody together. Wow. Okay, everyone stayed on though. Unfortunately, they sacrificed some distance. Nobody making it past nine. Well, you gotta adjust for your strategy. Move on to the shiny swarm and mellow yellow. Oh, mellow yellow puts one in the basin. Okay. Result for the shining Damn, swarm. shining swarm. Three in the nine. That is a tremendous result. Okay, well, that's a top contender if I've ever seen one. Going to be the leading point total. Thirty-seven. Yes, it is. Just three from a perfect forty. That's like the pinkies in balancing. It's <laughs> so impressive. I still need to get something from the holiday collection. I think I might get that sweater. And Mellow Yellow. Oh! <gasps> Mellow Yellow has a team member that has shot off the side of the... How does that happen? What happened there? They've got one all the way back in the three, two in the eight. All of the Shining Swarm are down in those final four valleys. How does Yellow, that happen? Oh, that was... Very interesting. Yellum. Oh no. Not I understand the struggle. Believe <laughs> Believe me. see a lot of beginning of the course versus at the end where they're trying to ooh, get ooh, the ooh, ending. You see a lot ooh. less contact toward the end. Oh, ooh, too bad. This is oh wait, somebody got stuck. What does that the count as? Have one stranded in between. How does that the happen? That counted as wait, no. Oh, that counted as a ten. So race control said that Pinky Winky, they have passed the Valley of Floor 9. 
That technically counts as a How 10. Wow. A 10 since they are past nine. But it's some real weird stuff going on. <laughs> Somebody got booted out of the track. Somebody literally just got stuck. Okay, so you want to get 30 or better. This is what it's seeming like. Quick recap, the race control decided that because they had passed through that valley of nine and were at the start of 10, they could give them 10 because they were not trapped in the nine. But interestingly, that gives them a tie break. Oh, look at this. Three in the 10. Wow. One too far. That is a great run for those three. That was a good recovery. <laughs> no, not too much. That 36 is tentatively good enough for third. Why is there a blur? The What's going on? Maniacs, who are down in 14th in the standings. They've got... Why is there a random blur? What is going on? Event, that coming back in the fifth event of what, is, what is going on? Silver at the time. <laughs> what was that? Can they do any better? Oh, 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 a little Old too fast. Mm. Broke one off well early. Oh, damn. A two. two spot. I think that's the earliest that we've seen a stoppage so far. But this is lackluster for the Minty Maniacs. Oh, they got bumped. What is with all these random blurs? What is going on? Oh, oh, wait. Were those? Oh, they were both on the same team. Lose one for a zero. See if they can gather themselves. See if they can get a recovery off of that. They try to stay in this one. Oh, going a little too fast. A little too fast. That can actually fighting for last place. Good job. That was very good. Nice work, team. Nice work. Do that again. Well, preferably do just a teens better on the second one. 32! Okay, solid. So 32 points for the Wisps puts them into the top 10. One run left to go, both for them and for this competition as a whole. Come on, Wisps. Get, get, let's get a 35. Let's aim for a 35. Slow down, slow down. No, oh, said slow down. That's really irritating. <laughs> That's really irritating. Okay. They have the same point in two attempts. According to the rule, Balls of Chaos has more 10 points in total. That means that they will move ahead of the midnight. <laughs> Annoying. <time>. Annoying. <laughs> How many points? Seven points. Okay, that's not too shabby. And a goal. Congratulations to the pinkies and the Okay, pinkies. where do we end up now? Can we move up one? Wow, the pinkies once again. Congratulations. Once again. Well, Oh, it's a much bigger gap than I thought it was between us and the team ahead of us. <laughs> okay, well down. <laughs> the next event is going to be the showdown, which is going to happen in a couple days. And then domino bowling is until December 3rd. We do have a bit of time before the next Marble League event. That's going to happen on Saturday, it looks like. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to cover the showdown or not. Well, I'm saying cover like I'm a news outlet or something. Definitely will be watching the showdown, but I don't know if I'm gonna make videos for it. So we'll we'll discuss that as I'm saying we like y'all have a decision in the matter. But anyway, <laughs> thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, if you enjoy what I do on this channel, make sure you like, comment, go on ahead and subscribe on your way out. Share the video because sharing is caring, and I will see you next time with a brand new video.